In this tutorial, you will learn how to use the 2D functionality in MC1. Typical use cases are grading, trenches for pipes, slopes and ditches, anything where you need to work with one or two slopes. In this example, we will follow the creation of a parking lot. Our parking lot has two slopes. One with 20 per mil slope and which we will use as the X direction. And one with 10 per mil slope and which we will use as the Y direction. We need to have a reference spot we can use as a zero height reference. This could be a stake set by a surveyor. In this example, we use a spot on the ground as the zero reference. Let us have a view from the top. Move the machine near to the reference spot. Rotate the machine so the direction of the boom is aligned with the desired X direction. On the panel, press X direction to orient your machine. To adjust the slopes according to the project, press the Model Option button. Enter the X slope 20 per mil. Enter the Y slope 10 per mil. Put your tool point down on the reference spot. Press 0. Enter your desired offset. In this example, we are setting the height to minus 20 centimeters. Now we have stored the directions and the height of the plane, so we can start digging. When you need to move your machine, then do the following. Choose a spot on the already finished surface as close as possible to your machine so you can reach the spot from your next position. Place the tool point on that spot. Press Store Height. Move your machine to the next position. Place your tool point on the same spot as before and press Load Height. You are now ready to continue digging. That's it. You have learned how to use the 2D functionality in MC1.